are here. Everyone died, which is great. Uh, apparently, they made it work. They made it work. It's a trick fired one leader instead of three. Outward. So they managed to solve the issues. Is Isaac here? Isaac Johansson? Hey, it's Daddy. You got my message? Yeah. But the only bit that got through was the first word. <laughs> that, that, that was enough. I can't believe how much you've grown. I would have given anything to him. Um... Isaac? Conrad here. Hey, Con. We're still low on carbon. We need about a thousand cc's from Habitos to finish up Vita's print system. Oh, really sorry. Uh, Odum's dropping fast, so Miyoshi's hydrogen request takes priority. But, but I'll, I'll authorize your request immediately, so Jill can add it to the next run. So he was a better, better leader. Is that MacArthur's ASC? Yes. I, I took him with me after the... Uh, well. He's the only people that survived. Yes. I really wish there were more, but it was... Been through a lot. The division, the violence. Our energy resources are really limited ever since that day. Uh, the only thing that we have in abundance is oxygen coming in from Habitas. Besides that, we really have to balance what our resources allow us to sustain, which is which is difficult. But we made it work. And so, if they take Habitas away. It looks even prettier than Earth. Yeah. The other colonists... They're not really happy to see me, are they? Oh, it, it's not that. Um, I never told them I sent that message. I don't think they ever expected to see anyone else ever again. 
home. So... There's a... something I want to show you. It, it took a long time and more resources than I care to admit, but, uh... I, I guess I just couldn't let it go. Ah, uh, he was building I their house. I don't have any words. Houses can't be 3 3D printed. When you're done looking around, I've, I've got a surprise for you in the kitchen. Wait, this wasn't a surprise. Well, uh, y yes and no. Uh, well, now I, I may be hyping up too much. Um, maybe you won't like it. I, I don't know. Uh, just, just enjoy and look around first. If you Spares, but her father actually built a house on Mars. I'll get that down. So, was this something special you promised me? <laughs> oh, uh, <laughs> I think I might have oversold it. Um, yep. Here it is. <laughs> a moon bear. Oh, it's a, it's a bear. <laughs> it's a bear. I, I know you're too old for a toy bear. I made it myself. With wood grown right here. O o over there, in fact, actually. I guess I just needed it to remind me of you. It, it is extremely delicate, so please be careful. Not like the uh, dozens you destroyed before. <laughs> what, what's wrong? Don't you like it? Found all these holograms about what happened here. Yeah. Wasn't pretty. What you did. Oh. Yeah, well, first stepping Sarah at the moon and then actually killing MacArthur and not taking sides of, of the conflict. Trying to be ne not neutral. I would understand. I, I think about it every day. I lost hope of ever seeing you again. I, I, I tried to stay out of it. Hmm. I've made so many mistakes in my life. But, uh, that day, that I had to stop them both before they destroyed it all. Why didn't you choose for Rosa and Homewood? <laughs> Why didn't you try to come home to us? <laughs> yeah, that's the good question. It's a really good question. 
he didn't want to leave these people on Mars. You're here. You're here yeah, well. I'm never going to let you out of my sight. I'm going to keep you safe. You're here, safe. I promise. <laughs> Dad, I. We came here to save you, right? Yeah. Save me. Yeah. To bring you back to Earth. You you want to, you want to bring me back, but I didn't send the message for you to save me. I sent the message for you to to be here with me. Yeah, well, that wasn't really clear from the message. What? What are you, what are you doing here? You want to take me back to the bell? What was the plan? What was the plan? I... She thought that... I don't know. Yeah. Don't know what the plan was. Really. <laughs> And she thought that she is going to save her father. Dad, we, we need to bring the Ox back home. Yeah, Earth is us. dying. No, 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 no. Ark Habitas, Ark oxygenates the dome. Ark Vetus, we need to thrive. I mean, if you take these away, the, the whole structure, the whole system collapses. But you said it's difficult to get the, by. The colony is stable. We made it. We made it work for, for all of us. You. <laughs> you must listen to me, Moonbeth. Hard choices. Humanity destroyed the earth. They'll destroy the ox too. Yeah, and that's that's why you actually left them behind. Or, or the the strongest nation. They, d they don't. Look at what we've achieved. Yeah, by leaving Earth behind. Moonbase. Yep, that's the problem. Outward. You had a pro. You had a job, and you didn't do it. Which caused it five five years that? of blackout. Nah, nah. They don't have a plan for Earth. They don't care about Earth. Isaac? Amira here. Please come in. Yes, yes, Amira. The Hobbitus rover is back, but could you please meet me at the Savannah Terrace? It's urgent. I'll be right there. Wait here for me, please. Mm. We'll talk through it all, I promise. Please. Okay. Is this stable colony or is it just stable long enough for the machines, ships, ships that they arcs to wear down? Broken down. They wouldn't have a problem unless MacArthur had destroyed the Ark. Both dead people were watching her, her mother and sister.
No oh, shit, shit, shit. How did she? No time. We need to hide. They're coming back. Where can we go? Quick. We need to be quick. In the closet. Quick. Let me talk to Kathy about this. Kathy? Kevin was certain, Isaac. It's Sarah Baker. She must have taken our rover back over here. Kathy! How did they even get here, Isaac? How did they find us? She's gone. What? Kathy is gone. Where did she go? I don't know, but find her. Please. Now! Unison, my daughter, the intruder, are missing. Lock off the entrance and check every inch of the dome. Find them. You're okay. I'm fine. Let's go. Quick and foil. <laughs> Sarah, I know what I did. I, I know what it means. It's all right. I, I heard everything. I have one too. Remember. We have to get back to Habitas. This place is swarming with... Guys, I've got a bit of a situation over here. Yeah? Yeah, those colonists really don't like you stealing their rover. They're trying to get in. Okay. I broke the elevator stream point and threw up some barricades. Big brain move. Be careful. You need to get back here. Or they're gonna stop us from leaving altogether. Yep. We need to steal another rover. Sneak past a ton of colonists. We need to press on to Arc Vita. Ryan, redirect Habitas's power to Vita and prep for launch. We are gonna head that way right now. We're doing this? Okay, copy that. Heading to the MPD terminal now. Be careful out there. Both of you. I saw a path on the way out. So Vita, yeah. Vita, Vita yeah. is... <gasps> yep. Just... Raw, raw materials, it's not oxygen, so it's not... Well, it's, it's essential, but it's like not... It's not like murdering some somebody if they take it. And Sarah needed to hear that uh, Kathy is not uh, not on her father's side, M meaning uh, given up on Earth. Quick, hide! Go back to the Ark, and we'll have bigger problems if we don't find him. Now let's go. It's clear. <laughs> okay, just give me one second. Facility leads to the Ark. Looks like it, yeah. How's our chances of just walking in without any hassle? Not good. I was afraid of that. Maybe there's another way in. There's a maintenance shaft that might get us there with a bit of a detour. <laughs> Maybe I can do something to create a diversion. But how? And where? That's the pump regulator that controls the incoming oxygen from Arc Habitas. You're right. Why? Look. No one is wearing a pressurized suit. If I temporarily turn it off, everyone will be forced to suit up or get to safety. We could use that distraction to get you in there. I can use the maintenance tunnel to get to the facility unnoticed. Kathy, I, I don't know about this. I'll meet you at the entrance. Okay. Good luck. Pump 
Let's find the terminal and shut it down. I had no other choice. First thing is, I don't clear stuff on still right now. I'll meet you inside. Hard choices. This looks safe. Okay, now, small break.
right back from the creative break, people. So we have a. We need to escape from here. Okay, that was a, didn't work out so well, but no harm done. Okay, so no, now we are okay. Please stay. I promise you that I'll be there. I'll make sure you're safe and that nothing can ever hurt us again. Beth, are you hearing any of this? Kathy, please answer me. Yeah, well, the problem is that. Colonists here do not really care about us. Yeah, 
Yeah, but Earth is missing. I'm through. Got the launch sequence started. Start your engines. I'll try. Kathy, let's go. Cat. I'm sorry, Dad. I'm sorry. like in the beginning so they had kept the art arc uh, launch ready I wonder why long day at work but I'm fine thanks for asking how are you I I'm fine just a long day at work as well anyway teaching game design So it's, it's something that's something I definitely want to do. Yeah, this is exactly repeat of the start of this game. Okay, he's trying to jump. Jumping ship. Cat? You got this. Yeah, her dad comes with, with them because he doesn't want to leave. Cat again. Okay. More rockets. Sarah, sit rep. I initiated the launch sequence from the control room. Copy. Proceeding with final checks. Where's the Initiating one of the crew member? Starting auxiliary power units. We 
that we not have that part anymore. Saving his life. Oh, that must be hard, hard with him. Yeah. Well, every every person expe except that one guy, MacArthur Bear, are really understandable. I mean, I, I can understand their motives in this game. Each each of them. Sarah is exceptionally flawed character, but, but, but really lovable. Okay, so they took both, both, both of the ships arcs away. Basically leaving colonists to deal with deal stuff with their, their themselves. I don't know, they might not appreciate it. the units and colonists. It's all worked out and uh, taken care of. Good. I love you, Amzadi. I love you too. I wonder what happened in, in other ship. I'm so sorry, Sarah, for everything. It's all right, Kat. You knew it was right in the end. It's what matters. Why did you come after me? I don't know. If you're looking for Isaac, I granted his request. He's down the corridor. Thanks. Did you tell him about Claire already? Not yet. No. I'm gonna tell him right now. Good luck. Yeah. Probably hard thing to hear, actually. So this is the print by your printer. Hey. Sit with me. Amazing stuff. That we could actually print uh, biomaterials. They might not have oxygen to appreciate it either. Yeah, that's the thing. 
leaving some people Took behind so they can save Earth. Biopolymer. Eventually someone found it. Biopolymer. Now we can create nature. <laughs> We're going to have to print a lot more than this if you want to save me. The keyword is try. But then um, I almost lost you and your mother one day. Really? Yeah. When this was giving birth, witnessing the worst storms we've ever seen. Uh, uh, rolling blackouts were a common occurrence. But this time the flood took out the hospital's generators. It wasn't exactly optimal, to say the least. We were born with an umbilical cord. Your umbilical cord wrapped around your neck. Ah. And your mum lost consciousness due to shock. Jesus. Lots of bleeding. I was, I was just standing there in the corner, watching all the nurses and doctors running around trying to save your parents. for humanity's survival. Yeah, but those two two others no from the Lunar Council didn't. No matter how hard we try, we, we just can't seem to unite. Mm. We fight each other. We have a common enemy or a common goal. We disagree on how to overcome it. We become hateful in our rhetoric and destructive in our actions. We'll steal another man's bread. If we're hungry, we'll destroy the home if we want it for ourselves. We keep, keep doing this to each other, to ourselves. As if somehow personal gain always triumphs unity. What are we trying to save if we ourselves just end up destroying it? <laughs> I really believed what I was doing was right. But then, who says you're right? Who gets to decide that? Good to hear your voice. What happened to the Eunice and Connors? That, um... It's worked out and, uh... That taken care of. doesn't sound good. Good. At all. I love you, I'm sorry. Yeah. I love you too. Even if there is a way of knowing that you're you're fighting for the true greater good, I and mean, why do you have to fight for it in the first place? God, how do you how do you stay strong? You're how do you stay? This is what we should do. I hope you're right.
we can be better. Sad overtones in this game, or rather game series. And this uh, this presents another question: What happened to the colonists? And about what happens to Earth? So, Kyoken could actually make mission us control. third game. This is Sarah Baker, commander of Mission Opera. The mission was a success. We're returning to Earth. ETA is six months, thirteen days, and right, four hours. fast travel. Mission Control, please respond. Oh no. This is our third attempt to reach you. Oh no. Are you there? Yeah. Might not end so happily. If the people in Earth started to fight, and, and we know there were riots already at the space center, so anyway, uh, last, last words. Uh, I really like this, and, and I usually give a small speech, speech, and analyze some some things at the end, end of each each of the game. And I really like this, how much emotion and gameplay and mechan mechanics the, the, the developers had actually added to this game. So this was much stronger in, in a sense of uh, mechanics. There were new mechanics, like the climbing stuff. I had like thought that idea with, with the both mouse keys, mouse keys that you can, could actually uh, use alternating for climbing, but I think this was good. This wasn't uh, over very long, and this wasn't as short as the Deliver Us the Moon is, which is like a really couple couple hours game if you if you want to play it. So yeah, lots of different kind of nice Martian uh, areas and the actual mystery actually kept 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 me going and kept uh, kept us entertained until the end B pretty long time the mystery uh, and and the mis problem with the with the mystery in, in the story is that when the mystery is revealed uh, the interest in a game or movie kind of grows grows small so i was really happy about this so how, how long the mystery actually hold on and I, I think the delivery as the moon that that also had like mystery that kept get us going pretty long time and you actually need need to find every hidden item to actually know where the colonists were going but yeah i i, I like the interstellar style emotional family story uh, lots of lots of narrative in this so, was it too much? I I don't think so. I I enjoyed the every every moment, and I'm I'm happy that I had a had a chance to uh, review the, uh, this game and uh, play, stream it <laughs> when when the game was launched. So yeah, R really happy about this. I I like I like the game. And sure. So anyway, chat. What did you like? Uh, did you like this game? Have you have you played this? Are you planning to play both games? Baby, 
I played both and loved both of them. Okay, that, that's that's nice. Yeah. I was, I was thinking that if, if this game is going to end, how it's going to end, is it going to be a tragedy? Basically, it was a tragedy, but they, they found her father at least, and he, he kind of jumps sheep. But yeah, I was, was really happy. Uh, I wasn't a big fan of climbing in that one, but the puzzles were fun. Yeah, the, it's kind of... Turns, turns you on or off, hit, hit or miss the climbing mechanics, but uh, when I actually think about game mechanics, there's, there's not many new game me mechanics you can you can easily invent. It's, it's like uh, guitar riffs. All, all the guitar riffs, riffs in the world are actually already in the, invented, so what's, what's the music using same same riffs all over the game? But yeah, uh, I haven't seen many games you use this kind of climbing mechanic, alternating the keys. I recall Witcher 1 had like, battle was like alternating the most most uh, buttons. And uh, that was something that people really didn't like. But yeah, that was actually, uh, actually I noticed that I was I was holding the mouse too strongly, so I, the, my, my hand got, got, got tired. So that, that might not be all the most accessible thing ever in, in game design that you, that you need to climb with the, with the boat, boat, uh, boat keys. And sometimes it, it felt that it actually changed the scene. So basically you click both, uh, uh, she's stuck in the wall and then you need to alternate the keys and it wasn't always as clear what you should be doing like the invert the jump from the, from the wall to another I, I didn't see any they were did any actual tutorial for it or it or at least I didn't see which is like maybe you should kind of give some hints how to how to how to do the climbing now it was like pretty short tutorial on in way. But yeah, I I I, I like the like the game. True. So next I think well it's still still well it's it's late. Or or, or I started today stream a bit earlier because because all otherwise things might might get late. So next thing I was thinking to continue Dragon Age Awakening. It's uh, something something I would like to play before 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 we actually actually get to the Hogwarts. <laughs> 